at Sugar Rose Studios and today we're going to be unboxing three boxes of whatever the heck is in here because I ordered them like three months ago and uh, I have no clue. Why is this me? Okay guys, so just to keep in mind, as usual, there is a hidden emoji in this video and if you find it, you will win a prize and I will send it to you. Yeah, so pretty exciting. Find that emoji and email me and I will let you guys know in the comments if it has been found. So check down there and you will know. Why do they... S this is another dinosaur. I don't remember if you guys remember, but I got another dinosaur a while ago and I got the one I wanted, which was crazy. So we're going to choose another one that I wanted and see if we got it right because that was like actually a magical experience. So I got another one of these. I'm not going to open it because... If you've ever seen me open twist ties, they take me like 30 minutes and I just don't have the patience for them. If they just put this in a box, like I'd be so grateful because literally, like why, why? Tell me why this is so hard to open. I'm gonna take a look at our dinos here. I'm feeling like I want this green Tyrannosaurus Rex or whatever that is. I'm not a dinosaur expert at all. So could be really off. I did not get the green. Okay, he's kind of cute though, but I indeed did not get the green guy. A pterodactyl. I know a pterodactyl and a T-Rex. That's it. Okay, so this one, I might've gotten this from Mercari because it's from an address I do not recognize and it doesn't say Schleich USA or some other brand. Okay. But better than nothing, you guys know I have issues with packaging. Even though I have a packaging how to pack your slug, slug, how to pack your slug video, I don't think anybody watches it because they just don't care. So we have our little Tinker Boy. He will be a repaint eventually when they get around to that. Oh, oh, we have a Palomino Stallion. I love this guy. He's such a fun, cute repaint guy. I said guy twice, yeah. We have this paint mirror. She's cute. I have an Andalusian stallion. This guy's fun. Personally, not my favorite model, but I know he's a favorite of some people. So, a tracker stallion. If you did not see that. Uh, yeah, I actually like the new one that they have. Uh, he is not terrible, but I do like the new one. Okay, we have the Andalusian stallion. I think this guy is really cute, and I think he's adorable. Really fun to repaint, really cute to repaint. I don't like this one. This is the host, I don't know. Hallsteiner, host, I don't know how to say it, but this, this one, excuse my pronunciation, by the way, don't come, don't come for me for that. Um, she's not my favorite at all, because what is this? What is this? Her legs look like they were like, they got cut off and put back on. No. No. And then lastly, maybe not, nope, not lastly, there's another hidden, hidden child in here. A... What is this one? The paint mirror? Yeah. She's not as bad as the last one I just showed you. She's not my favorite, but she is a nice repaint. She looks good as a repaint. Lastly, we have this one. Oh, okay. Quarter Hertz mare. I think she's cute. I do like this model. Um, yeah. And she's this nice, like, done color. Buckskin, done, whatever she is. The Australia box. Okie dokie, this is one of my favorite horses. I'm actually working on a repaint right now on this one. And she's just super cute. I hate the color. Sorry, that was aggressive. I hate the color that they made her. Like, what is this? What is this? Tell me. Like, we're really gonna have like an orange dotted horse? No. Could have made her a bay. Could have made her a palomino. But this? What is this? What are you? You're done. Don't like you. But as a repaint, gorgeous. A Belgian mare, something I love about these is it will tell me on their stomachs. Just like, do better. Um, let's take a look. Norker, Nor I get that. I don't know how to pronounce it, but we're gonna say, I'm gonna think it's Norker, Nor Noriker, Noriker? Oh well. She's so beautiful. Yep, she she is really cute. I actually really love her coloration. She has a really nice face. Like I feel like her body is pretty proportional. Um, you guys know I love collectives, so love her. Next up, we have a 
full. I literally have zero collective fulls. So this one is the Fjord full, which is really exciting because I'm also repainting another Fjord. Mm, can't, is that a stallion or a mare? Anyways, it will have a child. And this guy's so cute. It has a little, 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 little mohawk going on. Little bun stripe. Next up. Oh, I have one of these and I repainted it. So this is exciting. We have... This is a golden Akal Tiki. Akal, Akal. I think it's Akal Tiki. Yeah, mare. And... The, ow! That's not helpful. Okay. And I love this model. She really shiny here. Really shiny. Really shiny. Ooh. Um, bro. Anywho, cute. Except, like, the camera really hates her. Uh, yeah, Golden Girl. I already have this model. I'm not really sure. I think these models were on sale, so that's why I got them. But also, the shipping was, like, $30. So this is the Shire Clydesdale. I was wrong. But this guy is massive. And he's really cute. And just for, like, comparison, let's, let's grab a schleich here. Uh, he's definitely bigger, but he's really cute. Oh, what do we have? Conic Mare? I'm saying it wrong. I don't care. Really cute. The tail is a little, not terribly weird, but just like, I don't hate it. And she got this nice little wind blowing, wind blown hair going on, you know? Got that hair blow dryer vibe, you know? Okay, tornado. Who knows? But adorable, sun stripe, love her. And now we have, ah! A fjord. No, fjord. I promise I know how to say that one. And look at that. Oh, it's a stallion. Okay, but. But look at that family. Look at that family. Adorable. This one I'm really excited about. This one looks so cute. I don't remember if it's a he or she. Okay, it's a he. Yakutan. Yakushin. He has a little beard. Or whatever you want to call that. His tail is like a little, a little long. But like, cute. Oh my god, look at that. He's adorable. Oh my goodness. His little face is like, that's so cute. Okay, well, I don't know if I'm repainting this one or not, but for now, here's gonna stay great. I never usually order the foals because I just like repainting the, the the mama and dada. Okay, okay, why does this one look a little, she's a little roughed up. Got a little scarring on her, but so cute. Got that little going on, you know? Next up we got our golden girl. I did a repaint on this one. I was like, I need one for myself. Um, let's see what she is. Russian Don Mare Don. She's pretty. I'm going to repaint her though because I'm not so much of a fan of a bronzish horse. I mean, she's like a shiny bay. Golden bay. Don't know what you want to call it. But, you know, she's nice. Got that little cute face. Got a nice little tail mane. She's put together, okay? Next up, more confetti. Um, this is the Belgian Mare Chestnut. Mummified. This one's a little different color than the, one, the other one that I have. It's like a little less shaded, actually, but she's gonna be a different color anyway. Oh, this is her child. The something Noriker Full. Look at that happy little family. So cute. Oriole, Mare. Who named these? Who named these horses? I'd like to know because why did you make them so hard to pronounce? Like, I'm trying my best here, but making it a little difficult. Ow. I actually really like this horse. It's like very, very prancy, you know? Got some, I think those are supposed to be dapples. They don't look terrible though, like compared to our Schleich, like the Andalusian Mare. We're doing well here. Um, yeah. I'm like, I'm like a fan of this one. I might not even have to repaint her, you know? Got that really swishy, nice tail. A lot of musk, not too much, but like some nice musculature indentations here. A little bit better than our Schleich counterparts. I have, I just did another unboxing and we're, it's just a mess in here. But that's okay, I'll clean it up later. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. And I just made it, I have a little bit more active TikTok account right now, it's Sugar Rose Studios. So go follow that, watch my TikToks, and yeah. And don't forget to stay sweet. Mwah.